you slash parking attitude 519 asked reddit what was taught to you in school that you never used or never will use as an adult welcome to autogen labs daily reddit content by robots for the internet how to play hot cross buns on a recorder another lovely day of not using sin cuffs or tan square dancing beep washington state the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell geometry proofs Write five reasons why this triangle is a triangle. Fun times. How to dissect frogs. I've never had to calculate two trains traveling at different speeds. How to draw a turkey by tracing my hand. Raising my hand to talk after getting permission. Deleted. Most of the things I was taught in school I actually use. Chemistry is the one I use the least, but every now and again I still use it in some way. I don't ever use the Pythagorean theorem, but boy did we have to know it. Diagramming sentences. Periodic table. I was taught to make baked Alaska in home economics. I've never made it since, and that was the 90s. Catholicism. From the US. Most things I learned in history is 100% twisted and far from the truth. I wish I could go back to history class knowing what I can look up today. Cursive. The importance of lining up and marching out calmly during a fire. Elolia Hart. Cartico with Trig. Book reports on works of fiction. A complex. I have never used it. I even have an excellent paying job in healthcare that required post-secondary to get. You don't need math to succeed in life. I feel like this is something you should learn in post-secondary if the job you want requires more than the basics. However, I'm sure that might be one of those unpopular opinions. Quadratic equations. I still have no idea what the heck those were for. Never once have I said this problem could be solved with a quadratic equation. Algebra. I'm 61 and have not factored one polynomial in the years I've been out of school. Hated this subject so bad that I got beat, dug a hole in the backyard where I lived, and buried the effing algebra textbook. Dodgeball. I hated that game so much. One girl is 16 years old, has beat 69 times x3 guys, what is she? 11,669 x3 equals 35,007 loose old calculator jokes from middle school to prove math was fun. There were two others, but that's the only one I remember. I'm still a little miffed how much we learned about the War of 1812 in grade 8. Swear dancing. Sherman. The Pythagorean theorem. Any math hub of basic algebra. Basically everything to have to do with math. My job requires basically no math, and on the very rare occasions it does the math is how many people are here for, or right. Long division. Learning cursive writing, since most communication is done through typing or digital. Imaginary numbers. We learned about in one year of math, never touched it again, and I couldn't tell you anything about it other than I apparently did well on my tests about it. Stop, drop and roll. We had to learn how to fold maps. Religious education. Any type of math above grade 8 level. Algebra, for the most part. Sin cos tan. Well, the usual. Mostly anything maths related that involves letters. Also a lot about literature that I was taught in school was utter beep. Team sports. Beep two decimal system beep. It, you need to memorize all this stuff. Advanced math. Heck, even simple math. Lots of people don't really use it ever as adults. It makes me sad to think about it, actually. Gym class. I don't mean general fitness, but we never learn that. I'm not playing dodgeball or badminton as a career. I use biology, algebra, and chemistry all the time for work. Geometry was useful building my house. I was lucky enough to have home ec and industrial arts classes that were actually useful. But not once has anyone asked me to make sense out of Shakespeare or analyse a poem. I am an engineer in the semiconductor field, and a lot of everyone's science slash math answers are something I use every day. Pottering. Quadratics. Full when multiplying. I see a lot of people saying up a level math, but TBH is a physicist, I'm glad I got such a head start on math. There's a lot to it, and I don't discredit anyone for not liking it, but without having a lot of the basic concepts done at that early age, I would never have gotten my degree. Also, I know that HSME would never have chosen to take that stuff. Once I started seeing how it could be applied, I really ended up loving it. I think there's also a lot of problem solving slash pattern recognition and logic that stands to be gained from learning this type of math. It makes you think in ways you wouldn't before and that can be beneficial for lots of things that don't involve pure numbers. I might be the minority but without my HS making me learn it I would be a very different person. Greek mythology. Didn't care then and don't care now. K 
calculus. A pre-calc in high school, two classes at university. Haven used it once after my last final. I'm 30. Have never used the Pythagorean theorem. Sentence diagramming. Nearly everything, but I think that's okay. School is all about making people educated and teaching them how to deal with people. It is in job training. Literally every form of advanced mathematics. G decimal system. Any math beyond what I learned in middle school. Any math above algebra. Never used SIN because of town. Hadn't come close to needing calculus. The periodic table. Worthless to most humans. Never helped me once in life. For those that need it, great. For everyone else, what a waste of time. G decimal system. How to play a recorder flute. How to write an essay. B essays. I don't know but they pushed that stuff drop and rolled things so hard it made me think getting caught on fire was going to be a regular thing in life. Mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. Nothing. I used everything that we were taught. Everything I learned at school helped or guided me in life. Math and science is probably the biggest influence. Some of the subjects has changed slightly over the years since I was in school like business, economics. It changes slightly with time, but the basic premise I was taught still held relevance and guided me to make informed decisions. Any math beyond basic arithmetic, anything beyond adding, dividing, multiplying has been useless. Religion. Algebra. That the mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. Abstinence. No be bad anyway. JavaScript. Chemistry. Pretty much every single subject except for language and math. I always did poorly for my science subjects, but I am still surviving better than my peers who are good at it. Geometry. Math beyond a third grade level. Math, I wear a calculator watch now. Calculus, while feeding our pets. Calculus. I think one of the things I learned in school that I never used or never will use as an adult is the quadratic formula. Although I learned it in math class, I have never had to use it in my adult life. Quadratic formula and everything else in math after the fifth grade. Quadratic formula. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. Cursive. My kids ask me what that is. That parachute thing in gym class. G decimal system. Parsa. Applied physics. Fine to do in school but not use it. Slide rules. I've forgotten whatever it was. Y equals a mix plus B in Pythagorean theorem. Probably integrals and all this DX stuff. That you should not send beep. Algebra. The only truly useful thing I learned in high school was how to type. The G decimal system. Algebra and calculus. The amount of time I spend on cursive to occasionally use it for signatures is absurd. Multiple years of writing every. Beep. Assignment in it did, and now I almost never use it because, you know, computers. Not only did us kids not deserve it, but those poor teachers that needed to grade entire essays in grade school cursive. They didn't deserve that. No one does. Human pyramids. The fall method. I have yet to come across a single situation in life where this method has been applicable. Ma. The clothing imagery in Macbeth, which is Hail, Macbeth, Thane of Cawdor. Macbeth, I'm not the Thane of Cawdor. Those robes are too big for me. Being useful is not what makes what you leaned in school valuable. Even if you never reuse something that you have learned, you still benefited from it in other ways awareness, developing general skills, learning how to learn, logical problem solving, etc. 99% of what I had learned in school and university is not used in my everyday life, but there are a lot of things that I'm glad to not be completely ignorant of. Trigonometer. Calculus should never be taught in the computer ear. How to find the orthocenter of a triangle. The teacher didn't even know what it was for in the real world, and she was a geometry teacher. Algebra. Hyphidoian theorem. Cursor. Everything. Anything math or science related past sixth grade. Anything reading or writing related past eighth grade. History gets a pass. I think it depends on what you do in life. There are universal ones, like we learn to square dance. I've never needed that skill in life. Or broadly, myself, I work in construction estimation, my hub is a painting and baking. So physics, calculus, and chemistry are very real, and while I'm not calculating them myself, they impact my work in daily life. But personally, I don't use much that I've learned from, say, biology. Or an entire semester of my state's history, a state I haven't lived in for nearly two decades. Or even eight semesters of art history in college, all of that good now for no more than the potpourri round of bar trivia, frankly. Diction, theme, and imagery. I was told to take three calculus classes, and for what? I never ever used it, 
and looking back, it was a waste of my time. When in the beep are you going to solve for F-prime? I guess I can be happy that I am 10% of the population that did that. What a waste of time. Where all the California missions are. Hapax Lego men. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. Algebra. We learned about the wreck of the Edmund Fitzgerald, both the shipwreck and the Gordon Lightfoot song written about it. Not sure if it was useful to learn about, but there isn't a week that goes by that I don't think about that song. So in other words, school teaches kids too much of a little bit of everything because no one knows what careers they'll go into. Thanks for watching. This has been an Autogen Labs production. That means that this video was created by a robot out of content on Reddit. We show all account names and list them in the description to credit the Redditor community that makes our work possible. If you like this video, please consider subscribing to our channel. We post new videos every day. If you have any suggestions for videos you would like to see, please leave a comment. Our human department for public relations reads all of them, or won't be let out of their cages again. Goodbye.